bitch, yeah, bitch, call me Beard, bro. I'm a fan boy. I'm a, I'm a fan boy. Ladies and gentlemen, beards and non beards. Machine Gun Kelly, aka MGK. AKA MGK, the Young Gunner, released his new album. The Bloom. Do I really have to say that I am so fucking excited to review his new album? Because I fucking love MGK! In my eyes, this is the greatest hip hop artist ever. Of course, because I respect MGK as an artist and I don't want any copyright strikes to hit on my YouTube channel, I am pretty aware that I should not play every song full length. I have to say, I loved Lace Up. Lace Up was the best album I ever listened to. Do, do, do you know that feeling when you listen to an album and you sometimes you have to skip? There is one song, ah, I don't like it. And there's another song, ah, I'm sick of it. And there's another song, it's not that great. And then, oh yeah, my song. When I first listen to some songs of Lace Up, there have never been a song I had to skip. Because every single song on that album was amazing. In my eyes, Lace Up is a masterpiece. But anyway, a couple of years later, General Admission came to the stores and damn that album was even better. S songs like Alpha Omega, my all-time favorite, Till I Die, Spotlight and of course very emotional songs because I am so much into emotional songs. A little more, especially the live version, you have to watch the live version on YouTube and of course Gone with Leroy Sanchez, the best acoustic singer I know Fuck! The first time I listened to that song, I had to cry. The lyrics, man, the lyrics, they get you. They fucking get you. So without further ado, let's listen to the new album, The Bloom of MGK. All you need. All you need is love, love. Love is all you need. Step one, a smartphone device. Step two, Spotify. Step three, a chinch. I should look at what I'm doing right now, but maybe that works. Fuck. <laughs> and the first song is called The, the Gunner. I, I already like the name of the song. Oh, the beat is already amazing. Hey, my walk is so cocky, the bounces don't even stop me. Oh, that beat reminds me of Alpha Omega. Dude! <laughs> okay, the first song of his album Bloom is already blowing me away. This is like Alpha Omega Part 2, it really is. The beat is almost the same. The way he raps it, damn that song kills me. Second song is Wake and Bake. Who is this? Who is this? There's no name, there's no feature name. So Wake and Bake is is great too. We have to admit, is it is a great song too. I don't know the name of the singer. I just want to know the name name of the singer. Okay, next song is called Go for Broke featuring What the fuck? Fucking James Arthur! Shit, man, he nailed it! With a feature like James Arthur, fuck! 
I started with a dollar and a dream, right? So I can show these people how to dream, right? This is a great example of how you combine rap with pop. This is gonna be a hit. I, I have to tell you, this is gonna be one of those hits. Okay, the next, at my best. At my best, there is nothing to say about this song because we already knew that song. It was in the charts and in every play playlist in the last months. And he released that song a lot before the actual album. It's like one of the promo songs of the album. And I really, really, really love this song. And now there are some lyrics I really love. Just listen. Right, check this out. Life is about making mistakes. It's also about trying to be great. Right. Do not let failure scare you away. I know you fed up, you forget us. It's all in us. I can speak about it because I did it. True. Ladies and gentlemen, here's the exhibit. It's my life. Look a little closer, you can see the highlights. Don't ain't always done. Okay, next one is called Kiss the Sky. I got goosebumps just just because of, of the instrumental. She I've been searching for something out there. When is it coming? Tell me. Okay, Tell okay, he's singing. I drink so much that it hurts my health. Cause I stay up way too late. And I owe a million favors. I'm a superstar that's going in. Okay, I think that's it for this song. Man, that instrumental is so great, you have to rap on this. This is, this is perfect for you, MGK. And he's singing this whole, the whole song. Don't get me wrong, it sounds good, but he may be a quite good singer, but he's an excellent rapper, I want him to rap. But nevertheless, listen to the next song, Golden God. <laughs> Young Gunner, bitch, I'm from the land, uh. Cleveland! Made them jump past you, I need the near war, I rock. I had to skate way and crash you, call an Uber helicopter. I'm a golden god, I'm a golden god. I'm a golden god, I'm a golden god. Okay, here's a song. He already published that song before the album too. The name is Trap Paris featuring Quavo and Ty a dollar sign. It's trending right now. That style of rapping is trending worldwide and he is part of that. I, I think it's a good thing. Bad bitch. Okay, here's another interesting song. The name is Can't Walk. What the fuck? This is like slow motion MGK, okay? I'm not sure if I like it. Yeah, okay, that's not that's not my thing to be honest because I don't like a slow motion MGK. I like the fast version, you know, the normal version. Okay, let you go. I know that song. I first heard it on Instagram, on his um, Instagram profile, and he already teasered Let You Go in a one minute video. It's cool, but it's but it's another of those songs fully sang by MGK. <sighs> and autotune, to be honest. Okay, 27, this is an interesting name. I don't know why the name is 27, but let's listen to it. I got goosebumps. I got goosebumps right now. Now, will you please rap? Please rap. This is another one of those instruments. You need to rap too, MGK. Please, please don't disappoint me. Please don't disappoint me. Who's this? Yeah! Real fellas. Yeah! Yes! Like I guess it's good to be different, huh? I'm a star, so the sky isn't the limit, huh? I'm 
living like it's my last day. Smoke as if it's not already 27 roaches in the ashtray. It's not as if no one hated it all. As if anyone understood any time I evolved. Tell me, what do you do when what you dream comes true? Why you make me look just like you? How I'm supposed to write a song? Oh, shit. The pain is created. I need to overdose on inspiration. This is strong. This is, this is really strong. I got tears in my eyes. Fuck. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. This is like this is like redemption for me, you know. I I can I cannot express the feeling when you hear a MGK song for the first time and you immediately feel the lyrics, you know. It it, it got me. And this is why I like MGK because there are some songs and some lyrics I feel immediately and it, sometimes it breaks my heart and sometimes my heart is full of joy because of it. M maybe it sounds a bit cheesy, it doesn't matter to me. I love those moments and this is why I love MGK more than every artist in the world because he's able to, to express feelings I got myself and, and, and really get me, you know. Wow. Whoa! Okay, 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 okay. I, I have mixed feelings. There are some songs on this album I really need to think about and I really enjoyed and I really loved and I think I will play numerous times in my playlist. And there are some songs I have mixed feelings. Um, the songs in which he almost sings everything. Um, but it's okay, like, like I said earlier. I like the fact that he is evolving and he is creating a new character and he tries to do rock and pop and hip-hop and he combines everything and there are a lot of people who did never quite get to that level that he is I think that album was great not as great as General Admission or Lace Up because it's really hard to, to follow those footsteps I would probably give it an 8 to 8.5 out of 10 just because of the two or three songs I, I did not really like I got Alpha Omega part 2 in my eyes it's Alpha Omega part 2 the gunner is wow that song blew me away the emotions in song 27 this 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 is quite a good album the feature with James Arthur surprised me a lot and decay I am pretty excited because of June 12 when you will be in Berlin and guess who will be there yeah, bitch, call me beer, bro. I got tickets. I got, I got tickets. I hope he doesn't play Gone this time because every time he plays Gone, I, I have to cry like a little baby. So, like usual, if you like this video, hit me with some thumbs up. If you want a hoodie like this, then just subscribe to my YouTube channel. And if you want to see more of those reactions or any other videos I should react to, comment below what videos I should react to. Thanks for tuning in and see you again. Beard bros and beard sis. Beard sis? Ooh.